You are tuned in to your dose of positivity. Hi everyone, welcome to your dose of positivity. I am Marlene of Marlene Motivates and also of the Marlene Saunders show and podcast. So today we're going to talk about don't stay in dark spaces. Now we have to understand that Dark things can happen to us, dark circumstances, dark people can come into our life, uh, dealing with those skeletons in our closet, uh, traumas, so much, so much can happen to us in life in general, period, that it can cause us to get into a dark space, a dark funk, a dark feeling. It's like a dark cloud following us around. But we have to make the decision in ourself that we are not going to stay in a dark space. So there's four ways that we can not stay in this dark space. So number one, you have to understand that you have the right to be sad, to grieve, to be angry, to be mad, to want to get all of these things out. See, all of that is a part of the healing process and that is very necessary and essential for each and every one of us. So you have that right to grieve and to be angry and to be sad, but Here is where the danger lies. You don't want for your whole life for you to feel angry and upset, sad, wanting to fight, being bitter, taking it out on other people. See, you don't want what is happening around you, how you're feeling to reflect in a bad light on you. But understand, you have the right to feel that way, but also you have the right to heal from how you have felt and the things that you have been through. So point number two, you have to realize that you can get out of how you're feeling. See, most of us have had traumas and been through different things and had horrible experiences and heartbreaks and lots of other things happen to us. But we have to understand that you don't have to stay in that. You don't have to stay in the bitter. You don't have to stay in the angry. You don't have to be labeled as a mean person, as a bitter person, as a spiteful person. You have to realize that, yes, something happened to me, but now here is the change. Here is the shift for you. You have to realize that you can get out of it. How can you get out of getting, feeling in that dark space? Just acknowledging that you have been through something and you want to change. Nothing can change in our lives until we have to make a decision within ourselves that we want better. We want a change and we're not going to just accept the ordinary anymore. We're not going to want to stay in bitter. We're not going to stay in anger any longer, that we want to heal, we want to feel better, we want to release all of the inhibitions, all of the 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 things that maybe before you didn't want to make changes in your life, but now you're ready for a shift. You're ready for positivity to come in. You're ready for a light to come into your life. All of it starts with just the decision that I want better. So point number three, 
we have to change our light. If you are in a dark area, turn on that light. Open a window. Start with some positive thinking, some positive thoughts. And I understand when you're feeling low, when you're feeling in a dark space, when you're feeling sad, when you're crying, when you're mad, the last thing that you want to do is to think positive. But it's all about the healing process. And when we feel down and discouraged, sometimes we stay in that dark space. We isolate ourselves from other people. We stay by ourselves, just stay in the dark, feeling sorry for ourselves. But we have to make a decision to change our surrounding, our spaces. And it starts with just something simple as turn on the light, open a window, put on some happy music, something that makes you feel good, something that's going to bring about a, a lightening the mood. See, all of that is shifting the trajectory of your mood. And we have to make that decision. I want to shift my mood. I'm feeling this way. And then you have to make a conscious decision right up here in your brain that I want to shift how I'm feeling right now. No, I'm not going to be angry. No, I'm not going to be bitter. I'm not going to take one moment away from myself so that I can shift some joy into my day. So this is the fourth and the last point, how we can get out of these dark spaces. Number four, you have to change your outlook. See, and this is usually the hardest thing if you've been raised a certain way. You have a certain thinking. You're used to being pessimistic. You're used to being negative. You have to make a conscious decision to, I'm not going to think that way. And tell yourself, that's not positive. We're going to be thinking positive. We're going to see uh, the glass as half full instead of half empty. See, it's about changing the perspective. It's about changing what you think about yourself. It's about shifting what you want for your life. See, nothing can happen and nothing can change until you make the decision to want better. See, you can change from the dark spaces and you can get out of those dark spaces if you want to, but it all starts with you by your realizing it, by allowing yourself to feel how you feel, by changing your mood, the mood around you, changing your attitude, and also changing the people that you surround yourself by. All of these things are going to help you to get out of those dark spaces because that's what evil likes. That's what people who want to see you fail, they love it when you're miserable. They love it when you're angry. They love it when you're bitter. They love it when change is not happening for you. They love it. They love it. People relish in that. But you have to make the decision regardless of the people around you, regardless of what people are doing, regardless of what people are saying about you. The question is, what do you want? And do you want to get out of those dark spaces? It's all about inspiration, positivity. And that's why I always say on this channel, just know it, just breathe it and be it. I am Marlene and I am the content creator for Marlene Motivates and the Marlene Saunders show and podcast. I thank you so much for tuning in. Let me know below in the comment section, how do you get out of your dark spaces? I will see you on the next one. Bye guys. Be encouraged, be inspired, be yourself, you will survive. Just know it, just breathe it, and be it, and live your best life. Thank you.
forgive me I love me I've been blessed that I have made a through I'm stronger and worthy I am enough now what about you I forgive me I love me I've been blessed that I have made a through I'm stronger and worthy I am enough now what about you Yeah.